Leanne McAdoo here with some breaking news. It looks like the Bilderberg website has been hacked. Yes, right. That is the BilderbergMeeting.org. This is the website that is used by the 1% when they have their secretive Bilderberg meetings, and it has been hacked. Now, Mikhail Thalen has this story up at Infowars.com. Um, it, talk, it talks about who this, you know, what the messages here contained at Bilderbergsmeeting.org. We don't know exactly when it was taken over. Charlie Skelton of The Guardian, who follows closely the Bilderberg, said it, uh, the message has been up since December 22nd. Um, but this message is, uh, it's got a hack back and it's got a message to the people basically trying to explain since the advent of time, humans have long forgotten to love and care for each other. We're being egotistical, selfish driven, and a couple of people have managed to get the power and abuse it against the weak. History is now repeating itself. It's kind of a wake up message to the people saying, look, these people are using us. They are dominating us, telling us, oh, you've got to work really hard and then you can achieve, but really that's almost impossible the way the system is set up. And of course, they don't really work hard, they just inherit things uh, from their this wealth that they continue to pass on, this power, and they don't really like to share it. But then it goes on to have a message directly to the wealthy uh, elite and these 1% people that attend these Bilderberg meetings. It says, words are not enough. Uh, to tell you how much we despise you and your dominant behavior. No humans stand above others. You will have to learn. Uh, dear Bilderberg mem members, each one of you have one year, 365 days, to truly work in favor of humans and not your private interests. Each topic you discuss or work you achieve through your uber private meetings should from now on benefit the world population. But here's the thing that is really, they are giving a message directly to these people who you know, we always like to point out here at InfoWars are building this infrastructure of control, this prison planet, if you will, with all of their uh, electronic surveillance grid. Well, they're actually letting them know, look, we will hack you. We're going to give you one year to start working in the interests of the people. Or it says, we control your expensive connected cars. We control your connected house security devices. We control your daughter's laptop, your wife's mobile. We tape your secret meetings. We read your emails. We control your favorite escort, your smartwatch. We are inside your beloved banks and we are reading your assets. You won't be safe anywhere near electricity anymore. We will watch you from now on. You've got to work for us humanity, the people. So this is a really intense message to take out the Bilderberg Meetings website. This is a direct uh, message to the wealthy elite. Here it's interesting at the bottom, it has a greeting to uh, Phineas Fisher. Cheers to Phineas Fisher. You are one of the greatest humans alive. And of course, uh, Phineas Fisher is a, a notorious hacker. He was able to um, hack into, let's see, a renowned hacker, among other things, compromised the notorious Italian security firm hacking team last year. He actually took over their website, took over their Twitter, released um, a lot of their private information. This was a, another group who was actually working to uh, sell spying tools to these repressive regimes all over the world. And so Phineas Fisher actually hacked into this group and released all of their software, all of their information, much like uh, with the DNC leaks and letting people kind of see behind the curtain of what's going on there with our political elite. They did that with the security far firm. So this is uh, Phineas Fisher. So it's no telling, you know, are they just saying, hey, Phineas, we think you're awesome and we want to follow in your footsteps? Or was this kind of a note to all of us like, hey, potentially it's me. But the point is, Whoever this is, they if they're if they're giving a nod to Phineas Fisher, that means look, we do have the ability to hack into an Italian security firm who is building spying tools for the governments. We can hack into them, we can hack into anyone. So this is a major warning and this is incredible. Like I said, what a, an amazing time to be alive. Nobody is safe out there, and frankly, the, the, what the governments are always telling us, well, if you've got nothing to hide, you shouldn't be worried about it. And it's very interesting that that message is now coming home to roost for our rulers. This is Leanne McAdoo for InfoWars.com. Stay tuned to InfoWars. We'll have all the updates.